Hi, my name is Naman and you are watching Shop Scripter YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about C Sharp Web Development, the complete roadmap to become a C Sharp Web Developer. If you are new to the coding world and want to become a web developer, then this video is for you. I break this video in three steps. So you, if, if you want to become a web developer with C Sharp, then if you follow these three steps, you will easily become a C Sharp web developer. I know there are a lot of other technologies in this field like PHP or JavaScript, which are dominating the, uh, dominating the web industry. Some other are uh, Python are also very important. But in this video, I'm particularly talk about C Sharp. So three easy and nitty gritty steps. Step number one, learn the basic of C Sharp language. Basics like arrays, loops, control flows, permitive types, non-permitive types, and uh, most importantly, list. These are the, some basic concepts of C-Sharp. On the journey of learning C-Sharp, you must to learn the some advanced topics like interfaces, abstract classes, objects, and inheritance, polymorphisms. These are some very important topics to learn. So don't jump right into web field. Just bef before that, just learn the basics of language and some advanced topics of language. Step number one, very easy, learn the language, C sharp language. Second step, learn the entity framework. Now, what is entity framework? Basically, entity framework is nothing but a framework which is used to interact with database. This is by .NET, uh, which most of the developer use nowadays. To interact with database so uh, you should learn the entity framework i know there's a lot of resources over the web you can go and search for entity framework and easily you will get to it this is your second step on the journey of becoming a web developer with c -Sharp. third and last step is to learn asp.net mvc now uh these are the, they, there is two words asp.net and mvc if i break the asp.net into again two categories then there's a asp and dot net Basically, .NET is a framework developed by Microsoft, which uh, which uh, which work on different platforms like over a web, also over uh, mobile. Uh, you you can easily develop the web applications with .NET. You can also develop applications uh, for desktop with .NET. So .NET .NET is basically a giant framework. Under the hood, there's ASP.NET, which is which is purely built for creating the web applications. So ASP.NET is the complete framework for web applications. And then MVC is a pattern, model view controller, which you, uh, which you follow to complete, uh, to develop the applications. So ASP.NET MVC is basically a combination where you use MVC pattern to develop the web application using c -Sharp and .NET framework. I will talk about .NET framework in detail in some other videos. But now just 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 need to understand this point that ASP.NET MVC is one single thing and you should learn this. These are the three things I'm repeating. First, learn the C-Sharp language itself, basics and some advanced concepts. After that, move toward the entity framework, learn it. Third, move toward the ASP.NET MVC. These are the core things to learn. If you learn these three things, you will become a C-Sharp web developer. And Technologies are not ended. You can uh, learn JavaScript, uh, you can learn jQuery, you can learn, learn RESTful APIs, you can learn the Bootstrap, CSS, a lot of different technologies to add up with this to make you more powerful developer. But these are the three core technologies which you should learn if you are a, if you if you uh, if you are the member of C Sharp community. Then these three language are very very important for you i hope you like this video i hope this video is helpful for you if this video is helpful for you please uh, give a comment if you have a feedback please put in this comment section i'm waiting for your feedback thank you thanks for watching